Amid the ongoing U.S. government shutdown, NASA's scientists are quietly pressing on, keeping their eyes locked on the mysterious interstellar comet 3I Atlas, even as much of the agency's public outreach remains on pause. This week, NASA officials are set to brief Congresswoman Anna Paulina Luna, who has formally requested that new images and data be made available for public review. Meanwhile, Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb has once again urged greater transparency, pointing to new evidence of the comet's unusual brightening and subtle non-gravitational motion following its close encounter with the Sun. In response, observatories around the world have launched a global monitoring campaign that will run through early 2026, aiming to decode the comet's mysterious behavior as it drifts away from the Sun. Since its discovery in mid-2025, 3I Atlas has made a remarkable journey through the inner solar system, reaching its closest approach to the Sun on October 29th. Around that time, astronomers observed a dramatic flare in brightness, likely triggered by sunlight striking frozen materials hidden deep within the comet. Spectral readings revealed fleeting jets of water vapor, carbon compounds, and metallic traces erupting into space. While such activity is typical for comets, the real intrigue lies in the anomalous acceleration patterns that don't quite match standard outgassing models, leaving scientists wondering what hidden forces might be propelling this visitor from beyond the stars. The motion of 3I Atlas has revealed a series of small but irregular shifts, pushing scientists to refine their models of the comet's orbit and rotation. These deviations aren't signs of anything artificial, but they offer a rare window into how interstellar material reacts to solar radiation as it journeys through our system. Even with much of the federal government shut down, NASA's core teams at Goddard Space Flight Center and Jet Propulsion Laboratory have continued essential tracking operations behind the scenes. A closed-door briefing with Representative Anna Paulina Luna has been arranged to discuss upcoming data releases and to reassure lawmakers that NASA's monitoring remains fully active. Luna's office confirmed that the request for transparency came in collaboration with Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb, who continues to advocate for open access to the latest observations. Meanwhile, the European Space Agency and several university observatories have joined the growing network tracking the comet's behavior. Now about 300 million miles from Earth and slowly fading from view, 3I Atlas remains within reach of high-powered telescopes capable of analyzing its coma, the ghostly cloud of gas and dust surrounding its nucleus. This stage is pivotal as solar heat wanes, scientists can observe how the comet's outflow changes, shedding light on its density, spin, and internal structure. All these findings will feed into the International Asteroid Warning Network's 2025 to 2026 campaign, a coordinated effort to assemble the most detailed dataset ever gathered on an interstellar object before it disappears into deep space once again. But the fascination with 3I Atlas goes beyond its rarity. It's a living laboratory for understanding how different star systems trade material across the cosmos. Early spectroscopic readings show that its ice and dust share traits with comets from our Kuiper belt. Yet its chemical fingerprints, especially the ratios of carbon, oxygen, and nitrogen compounds, stand apart. These subtle differences hint that 3I Atlas may have formed in a colder, more distant protoplanetary disk, possibly orbiting a dim, low-mass star. Unlocking those details could help scientists refine their theories about how water and organic molecules travel across galaxies, seeding new worlds along the way. If 3I Atlas turns out to contain isotopic ratios beyond those found in our solar system, it could rewrite part of what we know about the chemical diversity of the galaxy. Such a finding would offer critical evidence for theories of panspermia, the idea that life's building blocks may travel between star systems and shed new light on how the earliest planets formed.
For now, the comet's irregular acceleration remains a lively topic of scientific debate. Most researchers agree it's caused by uneven jets of gas venting from the surface, likely triggered by differences in its crust or spin pattern. Yet some anomalies linger. Avi Loeb and his team continue to argue that scientists should examine the physics behind this motion without bias. Not because it suggests anything artificial, but because unexplained behavior can reveal new natural mechanisms. Both NASA and the European Space Agency have emphasized that current data show no evidence of anything other than a natural comet. Still, they agree that 3i Atlas's curious behavior deserves extended observation and analysis. This careful, collaborative response stands in sharp contrast to the frenzy that followed the 2017 discovery of Oumuamua, when limited data led speculation to outpace science. What's different this time is the unprecedented global coordination. More than a dozen institutions, ranging from national space agencies to university and amateur observatories, are working together under the International Asteroid Warning Network. Their goal, to capture multi-wavelength data in visible, infrared, and radio light, mapping 3i Atlas's gas emissions, dust density, and compositional changes as it cools and fades. Early results even hint that the comet may be developing a faint ion tail, a first for an interstellar object observed with this level of precision. Each observation moves scientists closer to understanding whether comets like 3i Atlas are common travelers between star systems or rare fragments flung into interstellar space under extraordinary conditions. But the story of 3i Atlas isn't just about science, it's also about how space research and public policy are becoming intertwined. Congressional interest in a single comet might once have seemed far-fetched, yet the growing demand for transparency in space data has made such oversight both natural and necessary. Representative Ana Paulina Luna's involvement reflects a broader shift, a recognition that discoveries far beyond Earth don't just expand our scientific horizons, they also shape our cultural imagination and political priorities here at home. NASA has confirmed that all data gathered during the government shutdown will be publicly released once operations return to normal. The upcoming briefing with lawmakers will outline how interstellar detections like 3i Atlas fit into broader plans for planetary defense, scientific transparency, and international collaboration. Meanwhile, the Pentagon's All-Domain Anomaly Resolution Office, the agency tasked with evaluating unidentified aerial and space phenomena, issued a short clarification. 3i Atlas is fully identified and poses no security risk. The mention was routine but significant underscoring how official communication channels are now designed to separate science from speculation and prevent misinformation. On the international front, the global observation effort has gained momentum. It's being coordinated by the European Space Agency alongside the Lowell Observatory in Arizona, ensuring coverage from both hemispheres as the comet dims. The goal is to keep tracking 3i Atlas until it becomes undetectable, building a seamless record of its transformation as it moves deeper into space. Researchers are also gathering polarization data, a subtle property of light that reveals the size and structure of dust particles, to better understand how the comet formed and evolved. These insights will add to a growing body of evidence about the origins of extraterrestrial material and the diversity of planetary systems across the galaxy. Looking ahead, astronomers are already preparing for the next wave of discoveries. When the Vera C. Rubin Observatory begins full operations, it will scan the entire sky every few nights, with enough sensitivity to spot many more interstellar visitors. What was once a once-in-a-decade event could soon become an annual occurrence, paving the way for an entirely new field, comparative studies of interstellar comets. Each future discovery will help refine models of galactic motion, revealing how fragments are ejected from alien star systems and how often they wander close to suns like ours. For now, 3i Atlas continues its slow retreat into the darkness, still visible to the most sensitive instruments. Within months, it will fade beyond reach, leaving behind terabytes of data and a legacy of unprecedented cooperation between scientists, observatories, and policymakers. Though the comet will soon vanish into the cosmic distance, its story remains, a reminder that even across light years of emptiness, our solar system is part of a living, connected galaxy and never truly alone.